advantage. Heavy thunderstorms earlier on today caused some flash flooding through the streets of Tuscaloosa. This is University Boulevard in Tuscaloosa. You can see the uh, high water there up to the wheels of some of the cars there on the sides of the street. Thankfully, that flooding is starting to subside. You take a look at the WVTM 13 live Doppler. We still have a flash flood warning technically in effect for another hour and seven minutes until 8 p.m. now, but you can see that the heaviest of the rain has come to an end. Just a little bit of light rain now through portions of the city of Tuscaloosa and University of Alabama campus. That heaviest of the rain now drifting down to the south. Still raining pretty good through portions of southwestern Bibb County. Across the Birmingham metro, we have some leftover light to moderate rain. Same stories you head south into Shelby County along 65. Moderate rain in a few pockets and some heavier rain through eastern Alabama near Anniston, near Jacksonville into portions of Talladega and Clay counties. The severe weather threat looks to be done with for today. We weren't really anticipating any severe weather. We really didn't see any, just the heavy rain event there in a localized spot across Tuscaloosa County. So if you live in the city of Tuscaloosa, some of that leftover light rain for a time this evening, then we're dry overnight tonight. Temperatures falling down into the 70s. Our forecast model showing that rain breaking apart, coming to an end. So mainly dry, it looks like out there overnight tonight, heading into tomorrow morning. But by tomorrow afternoon, we do it all over again. Those clouds, they begin to build around lunchtime, and we see a pretty good coverage of showers and thunderstorms heading into tomorrow afternoon. So for that reason and the impact day on the seven day forecast, the rain could obviously have an impact on your day to day activities, especially if you have those outdoor plans tomorrow. Same deal Sunday into Monday, elevated rain chances outside of the rain remaining hot and humid. Daytime highs climbing to around 90 degrees. You're watching WVTM 13 News.